That same kind of tier is um, in that 15 to 17 million range. Um, Calvin Ridley, uh, Ridley um, didn't play for a couple of years, had a pretty good year with the Jaguars this year. What do you see in this clip uh, with Ridley? So this is the guy that I, you know, I can't quite figure out. So physically, he's as good as it gets. He's 6'1", he's 190, you know, a big guy. He's, got a, he's an incredible athlete. Um, I don't know if he's quite ever lived up to the potential that he has and the potential athletically what he's had. So right here, you just get his inside seam with the curl on the outside. He does a great job of sitting in the hole, but you're going to see the route. He's going to push vertical. He's going to sit. That tells the quarterback when to throw the ball, snaps it really quick. He can change levels really fast, which is hard to do, uh, which allows him to go from a full sprint to, you know, stopping on, on a dime. Uh, he's got great acceleration. He Again, he's great. He's, he releases very well because of his size and his hands. Uh, he runs the ball very well after catch. He's very good at contested catches. Um, he can also run jet sweeps. He can also run, do some of the stuff that the Browns like to do. But this is a complete receiver who can play inside or outside. He's kind of got some slot type uh, ability, but he's a big guy that can play outside. Uh, a guy I haven't quite figured out because when you watch him on film and do some, uh, watch some of the things he does, he's the next level talent. Yeah, and it'll be interesting to see um, what his market is and, and how that develops.